um, last week, Thursday, I believe, um, there was chatter on social media um, that they saw ATVs in Somerset. And I, let me just say that I take some particular offense at people who see things and jump right to the conclusion that they have been misled or lied to. Mm -hmm. um, the ATVs were brought out last week at my request um, okay. because part of my due diligence, unlike all of the people who have objected, who have never seen the things, never read the things, never heard them, is to actually go in and, and, and test them. Mm -hmm. and, and so at my request last week, Thursday, the Minister of Transport and I went to the West um, to view the vehicles, to ride the vehicles, to listen to the sound of the vehicles, and to hear from those people that are proposing to bring them in. And just to be clear, I was quite impressed that they were, they were brought to the Beacon Hill Depot, mm -hmm. um, but I was quite impressed that the proprietors actually went to TCD and got a one-day license in which to do so, mm -hmm. um, and so and had the paperwork to, to, to show to us. Um, so a decision, a final decision has not been made as yet. I do have the whole package now on my desk in terms of the people who have objected. I had a most recent letter over the weekend from, from an, uh, one of the groups that has already objected, um, suggesting to me that I, they hope that I... Um, will consider their objections. I take offense to that. If I said I'm going to do it, I'm actually going to do it. And so when you say you hope, what you're saying is that you don't believe me. And so, yes, I'll still take it. I'm irritated, but I'll still take into consideration all those people who provided an objection, one of the, one of the areas, all, the, all those people who live within the area. And I stick by my position that I, I enunciated publicly before, that if you live east of White Hill, you don't get a say in this. You don't get a say in this. For God's sakes, I am sick of us being the country of no. We say no to everything and every action. Now, what's the question? You don't, it's not affecting you. You don't live in the West, so you ain't going to hear the bikes. You don't, you know, I mean, it just, it's just, it's astounding to me how all these people who live nowhere near the issue object to it. And so, no, they will not be, their, their views will not, I say they won't be considered, and I'm not going to look at the 500 people who live west of, east of White Hill, but I can tell you that their objections are the same as the 160-odd who live west of White Hill. So their objections will be considered. They just won't have the weight of having we, um, um, objected to it, having any, any bearing on the decision that's going to be made.